guys, I'm Andy. I'm Dodge. And this is Big Mac Workshop Painting Studio and we are doing another Bantling Brushes for a very, very important reason. A good competition. Um, yeah. A fair few entries. I would have expected more. Yeah, it would have been nice to have a few more comments, but you know, we're still only a small channel, so it's all, uh, it's all good. Uh, but yeah, so uh, those of you who uh, have commented in the uh, comment section below uh, will be uh, in with a shot of getting this bad boy, what's down here somewhere? This guy. Um, oh, there he is. Uh, so, congratulations to whoever wins, commiserations to whoever doesn't. Uh, there'll be more giveaways, but at the moment we can only we're only really doing them at the milestone. Yeah. So, as and where, uh, uh, as we start getting a bit more funding from uh, videos, uh, etc., uh, we will do what we can when we can. That we will. Because. People like free stuff, and we like we like giving them away as well. We keep, we keep telling you guys, we don't we don't have a Dark Elder army. We just painted it for the tutorial. Now we need rid of it. Yep. So someone's lucky. Ah. Uh, so what's on the next bullet points? So uh, my vlog is coming up soon. That's coming out tomorrow. Tomorrow, yeah. Uh, so you get to waffle, uh, listen to me waffle uh, for a bit. So building a board for armies on parade yeah armies on parade board plus some other bits and pieces as well isn't it and then on thursday you've actually got some video for your armies on parade yeah stuff um snuggles has got a final paint job as a tutorial yep uh so uh that's the uh thursday vid so that's a this time the uh white shows up a lot better on camera we yeah it finally took, got a decent took video a lot on more it. time working with a camera yeah um a bit of a pain Yes. Recording any white or black is usually a huge pain. It is a bit of an headache at times, yeah. So yeah, that's, uh, that's coming up for this week. Uh, so we've got some, I've got plenty of stuff coming up. Obviously, uh, October's coming up. Well, Where are the previews? Hey. <laughs> Hurry up, Games Workshop. I'm getting fed up now. Yeah. I just want to put my orders in. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we've got some money here. Waiting for waiting for uh, some pre pre order stuff coming up. I say if it's not out by next week, we wog and just <laughs> go down there, tear it up like a horde of orcs. Well, it'd be a small horde of two of us. Yeah. We need a cloning machine. That's the last thing we need. <laughs> imagine all the work we couldn't get done. Yeah, imagine all the uh, stuff would break in my presence. Yeah. We're not, who said we're cloning you anyway? <laughs> yeah. yeah, so October previews. Come on, guys, we want some. Yes, we do. Um, but speaking about October, yeah, I've um, currently the paint jobs that we've got um, for the knobs. We're doing the goths. That's partly done. Flash git, not flash gits, Sorry, bad moons just instantly made me think flash gits. That one. And uh, blood axes. In it's the blood axes are sort of a mashup between blood axes and death skulls because I've decided to go for a, a blue combat like a camo pattern. So that way, it's a it's a bit of both. You can miss out the camo and just do that for the um, blood. Up. No, death skulls. I'm getting proper confused with the names. Those two I always mix up. Yeah, fair one. So it was easier just to mash them together and do them both in one. To be honest, if you ask me, the orcs and all be all the same to me. Uh, green skin. Yeah. And <laughs> very loud and smelly. Exactly. It's like. So yes, uh, that's uh, coming up for uh, our October feature. Um, uh, so that's going to be quite cool because it uh, means that he's doing all the work for a change. <laughs> when am I not doing all the work, <laughs> you lazy git? So we we wanted to make or into this competition thing. Yeah, I yeah. Because I was going to say we wanted to make this um, as fair as uh, possible. That's why we've done the raffle thing. So why I'm going to go through these comments. Andy's going to write them down with the sharpie and put them in the orc dice bag. So. It's all fair and reasonable, and you guys can see what we're doing. And while he's doing that, I'm going to go through your comments, and we're going to respond to your comments while we're at it. Okay, who's the first one? Love Minis, who pops up quite a lot. Also a bit of a shout-out to all these people as well. Love Minis is always in the comments, so he would love to win that model. Straight to the point, why not? I'll just show it to the camera. Love Minis. See, these two always pop up first in the comments. There's three that always pop up. Then there's the Johnsonator. 
I'll drop a comment, a tiny... This one actually did make me laugh out loud when I was reading this at home to myself. It's, just, it's the pauses in it. I'll drop a comment. One little comment. Some may say a silly comment, but a comment all the same. <laughs> uh, yeah. Thanks, Johnsonator. That one gave me... That one, buddy. That uh, one tickled me, that one did. Richard Lamb, who um, suggested some ideas for our Patreon and um, we'll be taking those into, into consideration. Uh, we do need help and advice now and again from people. Yeah. And we're definitely trying to build up a community. You see, I'll mention the community thing a bit more when I get down to the next comment. This certain somebody. Richard Lamb's suggestions for Patreon. If you're going to do a raffle for minis like this then put in an extra entry for each of the patreons which i think is actually quite fair yeah i think that's a really good idea so if you're getting pet and things i think that's something we're going to take on board so if you do pay, uh, get patreons whenever we do raffles your votes counts too pretty much um we're also trying to still figure out a way with patreon there's a couple more patreon comments which is advice for a change which is really yeah. useful um so that if you do invest on patreon and send us money that you're guaranteed to get something rather than just being in raffles patreons will always get something you know what i mean over time we're just yeah. trying to come up with a system where that'll work best for everybody um without filling all the patreon tiers like the donation tiers with rant so much stuff that you, you can't be bothered to read through them all yeah uh, trying to streamline it but also make it efficient at the same time and fun yeah gotta have fun Otherwise, what's the point in all of this? Now, Leon T66, um, who we actually know, who just screams orcs at me, and it's mine, I tells you, mine. <laughs> <laughs> if you need practice, not that you need to, uh, I have a few Talos that could use a lick of paint. No. <laughs> not a chance, Leon. There's your answer, mate. This, this is why we make <laughs> tutorials, so you can do it yourself. Um... But, you know, what was I going to mention about Leon and the community? Now, Leon did a shout-out video very recently, which I watched. It was a good video, Leon, and a good idea. Now, we've been going on about community for a while. We're not necessarily going on about shout-outs here, but you can use video logs, other comments and stuff, or even our vlogs to start talking to other small channels and YouTubers. Yeah. Maybe we should start doing that with our vlogs. I mean, I enjoyed talking to uh, Captain Morgan's War Games. Yeah, yeah. He's all about strategy and stuff. It'd be nice to get a bunch of us together, including little small channels, and just start using the vlogs to talk about topics and stuff like that. Yeah, it makes sense. Um, so I, you know, I enjoyed reading that comment. That was a good video, Leon. That's a good idea as well. Captain Machine. Those bases look great. I think I'd like to mount my character on those, uh, make them stand out. For a Patreon idea, sell as one-off items a video request so people can pay to see you paint the model of their choice. We like that idea. Captain Machine, well, that is a very good idea, Captain Machine. So that would be a paid-for content where um, you'd build up the money or you guys would all chip in together and be like, we want to see you do this, and that money would just cover the... The model cost pretty much, you know what I mean? And yeah. boom, get that done. I mean, we have no problem painting almost anything. Yeah, we'll paint we'll really anything. Well, for Forge World kits and stuff like that, you know, where yeah, yeah. you need a bit of help with people chipping in together to get them. Now, the next comment is from the Orc Boys, who pops up now and again. Um, but he did specify he didn't want to be added into the competition, probably the same reason as us. He has absolutely no use for it. Fair enough. And I thought that was good of him. It's like, yeah. I've commented, but don't don't give it us because so a someone, el someone, else would, yeah. someone else would get it. So a special shout out to you. Well done, mate. That's proper sportsman-like and etc. Yeah. Eight orc tutorials. And of course, he's really excited about the tutorials coming up. I should imagine he is. With a name like the Orc Boys, a uh, bit of a hint as to where his allegiance is like. Yeah, just a bit. <laughs> I don't ever know, never know. It could be how far he is. Everyone is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah but that'd be really crafty of Alpharius yeah disguise himself as an orc so who's the next one um, Danny Eccles who left two comments see I don't read very well and Andy's left me doing the reading would love to see you work on some of the other rangers uh, that was a that was a comment from last time we were saying some other rangers would be good Andy tells me that Horde's got a bunch of monsters and stuff in it like that so that might be interesting 
Yeah, I reckon uh, Hordes would be all, uh, right up your alley. And he's also asking about bases as well, which are just on our eBay store, guys. The uh, links for your eBay and everything else are always in our video description. Yeah, so just check out the descriptions. And they're always for sale because yeah. we cast them, so I've got like an infinite supply. So if there's anything you want on the base range, just check us out on eBay. Um, obviously, if you know us personally, then just ask. Yeah. Um, and then Jinx Panduit. Andy, you did my Chibi Shark proud. Thank you very much. I'd like to see uh, Reaper Minis D and D paint vids. Um, from what I remember, the Reaper medals are quite cheap. Uh, so that oh, they're that weird bendy resin that's not quite solid. No, no, no. Uh, Reaper, uh, Reaper models do metal. Uh, there's a little white metal. Uh, they've got some really cool stuff. They tend to uh, sell their stuff as single figures uh, yeah. for like three or four quid a model. So I'm sure we could manage something like that. Uh, single figures are always good. And also, it gives us things like wizards and random demons and stuff. So we could always, um, it's always worth uh, having a look at. Oh, you do know I like a random demon or monster. And there's one last comment by some idiot that I know. I don't it's, know what you're on about. It's <laughs> oh, it's big big mech Andy. <laughs> I reckon I should be in this. <laughs> hey, can I enter for the Talos? Which the response was, no, you can get back to work and stop mucking about. <laughs> so yeah, if you're wondering who that is, that is actually Andy's, That's me. <laughs> Andy's YouTube thing, so he can start commenting on stuff, seeing as uh, I'm not always around yeah, to, so to log in, etc. That is uh, this clown here. Uh, so if you ever catch, up, uh, catch me answering a question, it is actually me. Um, so there you go. Great, they're all in a bag. We've got no bullet points left. We've got no bullet points, so we're actually going straight into the meat and veg of what we're doing here today. Give this a good shake. Probably could do with something a little bit bigger to put it in, really. Well, as long as I can't see what's in there. I think this was a decent way of doing it. Nice well, and fair. Also, after so, I've drawn this. Good luck, guys. Great. I don't know. That's one, isn't it? Yep, yeah. that's one. Oh, that had to be our number one fan, isn't it? Johnsonator! Congratulations, dude! Well done, mate. <laughs> so you've got yourself a Talos. Um, if you could do us a favour and... See if I can get that in focus, because everything's out of focus. Yeah, that should pick up. If you, could, if you could um, get us a message to, get a message to us on Facebook um, for your... to get us your uh, delivery details, it will get out to you as soon as we've got the information. Yeah, um... So congratulations on that, and the rest of you guys start thinking what do you want for the 2,000 sub giveaway? Because by the time we got this video out, we're at 1,600. Yeah, so th um, think something cool, you know, reasonable but cool, and uh, within a fair price range as well. Yeah, guys. That's, what, that's what we mean. Reasonable. But something about this size, something good. Yeah, something like dreadnought sort of price. Yeah, that seems reasonable. I'll do something like that. And uh, have a think. Doesn't matter what range. Um, let us know. And uh, we'll do something really cool for the 2000 sub giveaway. Yeah. That's a big milestone. Yeah, that's going to be huge. I'm looking forward to that one. We're just open for suggestions. Uh, rather have people, you know. This is another thing you can do on Patreon. You can actually send out um, surveys and questionnaires and actually get the numbers back of what people want rather than just using the comments. Yeah, so you guys should really join us on Patreon. So we give more of this stuff away. We'd like to give something away every month. That'd be really cool if we could. Yeah, because like I'm saying, it's just cluttering up the studio at this point. Yeah, and we start uh, obviously um, at the minute. Uh, we've got we're starting to run out of fresh stuff, so we need fresh ideas and we need fresh models, and it all helps. But thank you for watching this video. It is uh, always a pleasure to do these sort of videos. Uh, we love giving uh, giving stuff away when we can. Yeah. So we'll catch you in the next one, guys. Take care. Bye-bye.